Hey guys, it's TJ Graney with KOZ, and August is upon us. Man, you can feel it here in the air in Texas, and I'm sure where you are, it's the same thing, just warm air, and it's like standing in front of a hair dryer. Anyway, um, August, the month of August is water in your curriculum. Um, Usually, it means going kayaking, going canoeing, going swimming, going to the creek, the pond, the lake. Uh, you can go to the pool too. I, I would recommend instead of going to the pool, maybe get a couple of pickup trucks and line them with tarps and uh, fill them up with water out on in the back of the woods somewhere and d do something different than just going to a pool and being distracted by the, the girls that might be at the pool or whatever happens. Uh, you can go to the pool, but just remember there's distractions there. And really, the, the main point in us being with these boys, yes, we wanna teach them something. We wanna teach them how to kayak and canoe. We want them to, to have a love for the outdoors, to gain a love for the outdoors, even when it's hot outside, to know that they can go outside and still survive in the temperature, whatever hot temperature it is. Um, but the real, the real part of this thing is to capture their hearts, to capture moments with them when we can talk to them. You know, they're gonna start school soon. Are they afraid of what's gonna happen? Are they living with their mom or their dad? Or uh, what, what does that look like in their life? Um, you know, I remember my uh, when I was a single dad and I would have Cody Ryan on first, third, and fifth weekends, and it would start on Thursday night, and he was always so stressed out if he would have all the right stuff. For, if he forgot something, he would be afraid to, to tell me that, you know, hey, I forgot my tennis shoes, and Monday I have a... Uh, class, and, and there's just a lot of anxiety and stress and I never knew that until he was older and that was his biggest fear and I just it broke my heart and you're dealing with boys that are living in that right now and so take the time to find out who they are and what's going on in their life and not just rush through an activity and make things happen that are cool and try and be cool with them because uh, because then you're, you're about the activity and not their hearts. And we want to access their hearts. Um, and don't forget that August is water and it's baptism month. So we talk to the boys about baptism. We even offer to baptize the boys. And um, there's a cool document in your trail maps uh, in where you get all your curriculum. There's a cool document that Rick McGee and I put together maybe last year. And, it's, uh, and it'll walk you through how to understand what a boy needs to believe and then how you baptize them, what you say when you baptize a kid. You can do it. You have the authority as a believer in Jesus Christ. He's commissioned you to go out and baptize people and kids specifically in KOZ. And don't forget we have like a, a brass dog tag that you can give them if they've been baptized. And it's a KOZ dog tag for being baptized in KOZ. It's a cool deal. But uh, just guys, don't rush. You know, the kids get rushed enough. They don't have enough of these moments where it's quiet and they're with somebody who's listening to them. And 99% uh, of their time is either electronics or somebody telling them what to do and just not being paid attention to and you have an opportunity to pay attention to them. If you're a dad and you're bringing your boy to KOZ, don't just focus on your son. The number one, number one underutilized mentor in our country is the father. Dads, you can, you can grab one of these little boys or one of your son's friends and you can have an incredible impact on their life by paying attention to them, listening to them. And your son can see that it's not all about him, but it's about you and him 
loving on other boys that don't have dads or maybe don't have the kind of things that you guys have. So don't miss that, dads, if you're a, a KOZ leader and you're a dad. Hey, uh, this August, in, in a couple of weeks, we're going to be in Lynchburg, and um, we're going to be doing a Train the Trainers event where the video, where you'll be able to come and train as a trainer. You'll be able to take the video and the training materials and go to churches and train those guys in that church to do what you do. So be looking for that email. If you don't get it, just e call the office or email me, tj at kidsoutdoorzone.com. We'll get you the information. Um, if you have some extra guys that need to be trained, you need to be ready to do that and get them on that training video. It's going to be so good. And, uh, and, and God has told us that the only way to grow this thing, to make it scalable, is for you guys to take it there. And so we want to give you everything you need to take this program to the hearts and the lost little boys out there. Uh, so, brothers, hunting season's coming up. Things are going to start cooling down here in a month or two. But like we say here in Texas, you got to like the hotness if you're going to live in Texas. Just take some time, enjoy it. Um, it's going to be cold and miserable soon enough, and we'll be complaining about that. So enjoy your summer, brothers, as we wrap this thing up here in August. Water, baptism, explain baptism. Love on those boys. They desperately need you. All right, regulators, let's mount up.